it's always a good day it's always a good turnout um, and it's it's good to hear direct from the horse's mouth on occasions from people like Nigel Davis and that, you know that you're getting the correct information there as well. I think uh, as a specialist in charities and social enterprises we've got a large number of clients in the sector it's an uh, absolute must do every year. I come every year uh, and there's always a good collection of uh, speakers, good collection of people um, and it's probably I reckon probably one of the best ones in the South West to come to both for professionals and trustees alike. Um, we do a lot of charity accounts work and I do lectures and talks on charity account and it's a great place to pick up uh, current topics of change and make sure you're kept up to date so they're always useful. Very good indeed. Very interesting speakers, valuable subject matter and uh, very informative. Uh, the highlight for me as ever is getting the words from the horse's mouth as it were from the charity commission. I think I think probably just the update from Nigel so far because he he's always brings you the current thinking of the Charity Commission and we get asked so many things about what the Charity Commission are doing, it's an opportunity to interact with them, so that, that Well we're really hoping that the firms have got to grips with their two new sorts and are thinking about how that's going to affect their clients. Of course we've got the FRS 102 sort based on new gap and new gap standard FRS 102 and for those who want to hold on for the Frizzy for one year, 2015, the Frizzy sort. So they need to work through the clients, which really works for them, get their training materials right, and think about prior year comparators and all the practical issues about adopting these new sorts. Well, yeah, it's, uh, it's all our calendar for CPD every year. I try to come every year. Oh, it's unmissable. Oh, a great opportunity for networking as well. And for us, the regulator, need to view the practitioner.